Hey there, my name is John Churchville. I'm coming to you from Ann Arbor, Michigan. I'm at my home studio where I teach music lessons, both in person and remotely. And I wanna give you a little uh, shot of the studio and show you what I do. So come and join me, huh? Welcome to my studio. You're seeing now what my students see when they take their lessons. So today I wanna to show you how I use my studio to teach music lessons remotely to students of all ages and ability levels. The first question many people ask me when I tell them that I teach music is, what exactly do you teach? The answer, I teach people how to play instruments. I also teach people how to use technology to create and play music on their own. In fact, I have a collection of some of my favorite music tools gathered on a page on my website called the Musician's Toolbox. These are all the tools I use to help people learn and develop their music theory, create and arrange music, and explore music making and sound. You can visit this page and explore these tools on your own at johnchurchville.com slash musicians toolbox. Check it out. There's tools there for exploring music, for learning music theory, and for creating music. So the next question people ask me is, who do you teach? The short answer is that I teach anyone who wants to learn. I teach students of all ages, from toddlers to elementary to middle school to high school to college students and adults of all ages. I sometimes even teach other music teachers. It's a lot of teaching, but I love it. People sometimes ask me, why do I teach? The answer may sound a bit funny, but I love to teach because I loved being a student. As a student, I have had many teachers. Some of them have been amazing. The teachers that inspired me gave me the tools, the time, and the guidance to discover who I was as a person, as a thinker, and of course, as a musician. I play music because, well, it's music, and it is one of the greatest inventions of humankind. Of course. I teach because I want to inspire students to put a positive attitude and their best effort towards whatever they want to do best. It might be to learn to play the drum set or guitar or ukulele, or it might be to write music or learn music theory. Whatever it is that people want to learn, I, as their teacher, will help them on their path to success. In the teaching business, struggle is good. If a student is not struggling, there really is no need for a teacher to guide them. My favorite students are those that keep trying to do better, no matter how many mistakes they make or how hard the struggle is. The two things that I cannot teach are effort and attitude. So when a student comes to me to learn and they bring with them a good positive attitude and they put forth their best effort, I truly believe there is no struggle we cannot overcome together toward accomplishing any musical goals that they have. I believe that every student I teach has the unique ability to change the world for the better. I do. And if that's not enough to keep being a teacher, I don't know what is. So thank you for letting me show you a little bit of what I do. And if you have any questions, you can always send me a message on my website at johnchurchville.com. I read every message that comes in. I would love to hear from you. Have a great day, everybody. And happy music.